Greetings to all of you out in Facebook and all across the network. I appreciate you joining me today. Today is the day that we celebrate uh, Sunday to celebrate worshiping God. And I'm on my way to First Assembly of God in Waxahachie, Texas to worship the Lord today. This is a day. This is a wonderful day that we can praise the Lord. You know, we have had freedom in this country for many years, and I'm thankful for the freedom we have to worship in the house of God. There's a lot of people across the world that don't have this privilege. They don't have the opportunity to really enjoy worshiping God because they're prohibited in what they can do. So we need to be thankful that we have a place to go to church and worship God. I know some people say, you know, a lot of things, the church is not uh, what it ought to be, and I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of flaws in a lot of places, but you know, the Bible says, upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it, and I want to tell you something for sure, God cares about his church, that's not a building, it's about his believers, and believers can worship God, they're his church. You know, Jesus is coming back after a church that's glorious church without spot or wrinkle. It's coming back after a church that's ready to meet the Lord. And I'm thankful today that we have the opportunity to worship God. There are so many things I love to, to talk about when it comes to the things of God. But, you know, day by day we have a walk with God. We, we have an opportunity to get up every day and praise Him and give Him thanks for everything he has done. He is our healer. He does things for us. If you have a problem in your physical body, he can heal you. He is Jehovah Rapha, the Lord God that healeth us. He is the same Lord. He always has been. Hebrews 13, 8 says he's the same yesterday, today, and forever. And that's a wonderful promise that we have, that he is the same yesterday, today, and forever. I'm glad that we have the opportunity to worship him today, and I'm praising him, and I'm thanking him, because the things that are going on in this world today, we need to worship God with all we have, because I know we're living in the last days. I know that times are getting difficult, but raise your hand and praise God today, and thankful that you have a, a life to live and that you can worship God. And I love all my friends and all my family that listens to my broadcast all the time. God bless you and may you have a great day for this Sunday.